Hey everyone, welcome back to Stormworks Build and Rescue. We are back again working on the Dapper Angler Tug. Uh, I'm really excited to get back on this. Uh, we got a lot of work that we need to get done with it. Uh, I think today we're going to be jumping on to doing our cabins. Uh, I, want some, I want a place to sleep. Uh, we need to be able to pass time. We need a place to store our passengers when we do rescue them. Uh, I would like a med bay. We're going to put a med bay somewhere in here. We do have some room. And we are going to be working on our gas tanks as well. We are only currently using the large gas tanks and this boat needs a lot more fuel than this, these gas tanks will provide. Uh, so we just got a lot of interior work to get done today. So we're going to get that going. And yeah, I'm excited to get going. But if you're not a member of us already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. It is free 99. Helps us out a whole lot over here. But yeah, let's get started and let's build. All right, we're in the workbench here. We've got our boat spawned in. Uh, everything is exactly the same as it was last time. I didn't do any offline work with it. Uh, I think maybe I painted one block. That might have been, I think one block was red here. That was it. But we're gonna be working in here today. We got this room here to work with. We got this room here to work with. We're gonna add some more gas because we're only using these tanks. And yeah, we can actually get rid of some of these weight blocks too if we're gonna add more liquid to this thing. But yeah, let's go ahead and uh, let's get in here. Let's start making this a little bit more neat. Uh, as we come down, let's see. Uh, how do we wanna separate this room off? Um, let's see, what is going on here? Um, make that flat. I think, I don't know what I think. Um, how do I want to lay this out? Let's do this. Let's, uh, let's do a, a wall across here. Symmetry mode would have helped us out a lot there. We like for that. We can take care of that now. Whoa, here we go. There we go. So that's walled this off a little bit. Now we can work in here. We've got a little bit of ballast room here. Maybe, uh, who knows what we'll put up here. Maybe, uh, maybe some pumps for a firefighting system. Maybe we'll have it squirt water out of the mouth. That'd be hilarious. All right. So in here, let's, uh, Let's get rid of symmetry mode. Let's bring this down like this. I think this will be our main room that we come down into. You can come in here and then this will be maybe a storage room, crew quarters, maybe, let's see, let's go and look at med bays, med, 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 med beds, med beds. There we go, med bed. How many of these can we actually get in here? Come on, rotate. Rotate, rotate. Okay, so if we platform this, plop that there for a second, we'll grab you back. Uh, we'll come across here, grab you. Can we get two of them in here? I don't think we can get two of them in here. No, we can't. Um, that's fine, that's fine. Um, image mode is off. What am I, what's going on here? We're just gonna put some blocks across here. This is fine. All this can be storage for medical supplies. I like it, I like it. This wall is really in the way right now. Put us a door here, I think. A better door would be put a sliding door in. How do we want this? Maybe we'll put the sliding door in right about there, and then we'll put some windows in. We can monitor. I think that will work. So let's go right there. Put some blocks in, and then I think, uh, let's do, do, do the large windows. They're gonna look all right here. Um, or, 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 or. What about our porthole? Our long porthole here. What an awkwardness. Um, you know what we can do? We can put it here. Let's do this. We'll put it here. We'll move our door down into the wall. Not a problem. And that'll kind of make it more like a quarantine type bay. Yeah, see, I like that. Okay, let's move our door. And we're gonna get rid of that door. Copy, copy this door. Copy that door. Rotate, rotate again. Put it down one. There we go, there we go. This is what we wanted. Now we can do that, do that. Awesome, now we got like a little med bay in here. We can put a bunch of medical supplies here, defib, all that kind of stuff can go in here. Perfect, perfect. They're kind of quarantined, you can monitor them, perfect. This could be also storage, uh, welding gear, that kind of stuff. Then we come in, that gives us a lot more opportunity for this in here. Let's focus on, let me build these gas tanks real quick, and I think we can get rid of a lot of these weight blocks because of what we're, oopsie. What we're gonna put in here is that enough will that appease the gods let's see let's do this put that block in like that where could we put this tank uh we're, we're already used to having the weight back here maybe we could do a low tank uh what's under this 
absolute water would be underneath that. Um, so let's put that block back. Put that back. Um, here's what we'll do. Uh, we're gonna go for symmetry mode again. We're gonna go right about here. And I think we'll come to, let's see, that's a 705 gallon tank, I think. Uh, and that's a what? One, two, three, one, two, three, five, one, two, three, four, five. So as long as we go bigger than that, one, two, three, four, five, two, three, four, five. I think that should be plenty of gas, especially since we have it on both sides. Um, like this, we'll close that off. That can be our gas slash carrying gas, extra gas, whatever we want it to be. All right, that rooms this off a little bit. Let's do this. We'll need some pipe right there. Just grab our straight pipe, straight pipe enclosed. Oh, whoa, whoa. Oh, now, doing it again. Here we go. Let's get in here. Straight pipe enclosed. And I think I'm going to go ahead and put two in here just so we can go ahead and run our air down the same path. Because currently our air is just coming up onto the deck. And if we get any water up over the deck, we're, we're going to kill our engines. We're also going to run air down this way. So let's grab that and fix this while we're at it. Come on. Go on. It's all about finding the right angle here. Find the right angle. Here we go. Go to there. Oh, nope. We're not erasing. We are grabbing. And we're just using control to grab uh, the, the piece that we need. Come on. Come on. There we go. There we go. All right. Grab some straight pieces again. Straight, straight. Now we can delete. Grab it, rotate it, done deal. All right, let's get rid of this on the roof here or on the deck. We'll close that in, come back down here. We want to get one of these guys. Um, we're gonna put it in right next to it and we're gonna do it the opposite way because we want it to pull air in. Go ahead and come to our logic here. We're gonna go to the exact same place that these guys are hooked up, which is right here. Perfect. Uh, what else does this need? Electricity. This needs el electricity. Come on. Electricity. All right, here we go. Uh, we'll connect you to there and to there. And we'll end up rewiring everything later. Uh, I want to put in a circuit panel, all that kind of stuff. Make it a lot easier to control, turn on. But for now, we're just hooking things straight to it. Okay, so we just fixed our air. Our air is going to be pulled in. Our exhaust is going to be pushed out. It's no longer going to be swamped. Uh, we need to come through here now. Uh, do the same thing. We're going to delete that. Uh, we want one of these. We're going to just try and rotate it the right way. Here we go. Grabbing a pipe, bringing it on. Here we go rotating it so we get the right angle. Let's get our yellow. Paint it up just so we know that's air. Fine and dandy, these guys, because why not? There we go, nice and clean. Okay, so now we can make us a better walkway through here. Question is, do we do put a door here? Probably so. I think we're going to put a door here. You know, honestly, we can even bring these gas tanks up another if we wanted to. Maybe we make four separate tanks. We'll see. Uh, that's going to cover our gas for now, I think. Uh, but we've got, let's see, we've got our med bay. Uh, this is going to be our storage room. We come in. This is going to have to be some sort of like walkway and then we're going to need maybe crew quarters over here. How can we do this? Let's wall this off. Same way our med bay is walled off and I did not need mirror mode on. Try that again. Get lined up here. Come on down. Bring it. There we go. Is this a corridor here? Let's do something like this. This is such a big walkway. That, do that, that. That still seems big. Um, we'll have to put a door here. Let's go ahead and just grab a door. Um, you know, we could use a custom door. Let's, mm, for now, I'm gonna put a sliding one there just so we can have some more bulkhead space, basically. Um, let's get rid of this, perfect. That will fit in there nice and even. So it's with the walkway, bring that on down. So that's to the engine. Now we have to figure out our cabins here. We can open up all of this, grab our door here, rotate. Come on, I need to do it from this side. What's going on game? Okay, here we go. Um, do one there, do one there, 
Whoa. And we can do one there. That gives us three cabins. Nice. Let's get on the other side here. See what we can do. Um, not a lot of privacy between these walls here. Um, what we'll do. Let's not going to be a large crew. We'll come back in and we'll have captain's quarters and then we'll have cr uh, crew quarters. So the crew's quarters will be a little bit smaller. Let's do that. Uh, there we go. This will be our captain's quarters. Let's figure out our bed. How far is our bed? Our bed needs to go to here. Put that there. Bring in our shelf to here. Actually, we can cut this out. Can we? No, we can't cut that out. Uh, so we leave it like that. Grab our bed and put that down there. Uh, let's see. We'll do that, 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 that. Maybe something like that. Does that look good? That uh, we're gonna go with that. Um, let's put some space like that. He can crawl up into his little bed there. We'll leave the steps here. Um, let's see, let's do something like that. Maybe we'll figure out some storage in here for his clothing. Something like that. I don't know. Uh, some stuff up here. Maybe we'll do some piping around here to make some sort of little storage rack. I don't know. We'll put some, maybe we can put some logic or some microcontrollers in here with some netting. Uh, that give us a good place to hide that. All right. So that's good. Cap good little captain's quarters. Uh, what can we cram in here? Uh, let's grab our bed. Grab our bed again. I think it has to be on this. How much room to work in here? Here we go. Uh, we can go here. Let's rotate it this way. Drop that there. Really not enough room. Here we go. All right. So that we can put some storage under there. And he's literally got a walkway up to his bed. That's all he gets. That's all he needs. Uh, we can have some shelving across here or something. You know, he's got to have got to have a spot for some stuff. So we can have that. Um, we can get a captain some shelving. That. Why not? Put some lights up there. And we can find better pieces for all this later, but just, just for the sake of understanding what's going on. So then we have this big area here. Uh, we got main, main area access. We'll have equipment here. More like a crew area. So maybe this could be like the galley. Uh, it'd be like a galley slash hangout section. Uh, then we lead into our engine room. I think that's what this is going to be. It's going to be a little hangout and galley, a little kitchen. Let's see. We need to... Make some sort of countertop here. I hope that's not too tall. I feel like that's going to be too tall. Um, maybe we go to here for our countertop. I'll have to spawn this in and see what that feels like. That could be a good countertop. And then we have a bunch of shelves for stuff up here. Uh, I don't know, a shelf across there, something like that. Uh, just some cabinets. I don't know. Uh, definitely could put a sink in here. Some sort of things going on. Um, and then honestly, let's see. Might need to figure this out a little bit better because let's back up a little bit. This probably needs to be our seating area here. Something like that. Let's do seating there. And then we'll come down like this because of this door. And then we can come down like this. Oops. We'll take, you know what? We'll, uh, let's erase that. Erase that. This is our kitchen here. It's going to be tiny. Going to be tiny. Um, so that. We'll go like that. That's our kitchen. Maybe a little stove, a little sink, maybe some countertop space here. Let's see, some countertop space there. Uh, so let's see, we'll go wall that off. We'll wall this off. Can I get a door in here? Did I build it right on the pipes? No, I didn't. We're good. Don't even really need a door. It just needs to be an opening, something like that. We can grab these pieces, kind of give it like a hatch look here. Yeah, maybe like a little service window something like that. Get your food and go maybe kind of thing. Stay out of the kitchen. Do a little service window here. So chef doesn't feel all crammed in here. Yeah, see, that's good. That's good. I like that. All right, all right. So we got that figured out. Got that figured out. Gas, gas is going to be figured out. Let's go ahead and decorate our med bay here. Let's go ahead and get our supplies and our equipment. I think we'll be good to go. We even put like a little porthole in the side here. Um... What kind of room do we have? One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So we don't, it's going to be even. Uh, we could put one of these long ones in here, but then that's below waterline. So we don't need that. All right. So let's go ahead and just get our gear like I was thinking of. Scroll on down here. I want to get some first aid kits. Let's get some first aid. I need plenty of those. Good. Plenty of those. I want a defib. I think. 
Man, it's really hard to work in here. Let's put, let's leave this as a working station. Let's put our defibs down here, I think. Uh, let's do one, two, three. No, we can't do that. Um, do it across here though. There we go, got a defib in the working station there. What else can we grab here that we need? Uh, we can go flashlight in case uh, we need able to see here. Uh, it'd always be good to have emergency flashlights. Uh, let's do one right here. Emergency flashlight. Uh, also want some O2. Where is our O2 at? It'll help sell the whole med bay idea. Plus, you know, in case we get trapped in here, we have oxygen. Where is our oxygen at? Okay, that took way too long for me to find. It was literally right there, but we, we, we did find it. Um, I'm gonna drop two of these guys in here. Um, of course, I did that upside down. Flashlight's upside down too, but I don't think that really matters. There we go, there we go. Got some oxygen in here. Some med packs. Let's, um, let's round this off a little bit. Let me get our inverse block here. We'll do that, we'll do this. Come across here, come across here. That looks pretty good. Um, this room's a little too white for my taste. Let's find us a, a good color for this bed. Uh, green's too dark. I think more in like the bluish, bluish greens, a little brighter than that. Yeah, see, that feels medical. That feels really medical. Um, like everything else needs to be white though. Uh, let's get some color on the walls though. Maybe just like a light cream or something. Let's see here. What is this going to do? That's a little too dark, a little too pink, yellow. Yeah, we're getting somewhere. We're getting somewhere. There we go. That's the color I want. Okay, so we can color all this. It's just a white paint that's kind of gone dingy over the years. You know what? We could probably paint all this. Let's go ahead and do all this. I'm sure it's going to paint the rest of the, uh, the interior here. Uh, looks like it is. What is going on with my controls today? Here we go. You, paint you, paint you, paint you, paint you, paint you. And then we get to see what all is painted on the outside. That's that's gonna be the fun fun part. I don't even want to attempt to paint all that. Um let's do this. That that now let's go outside and see what we have ruined. Nothing. Um let's see, did it paint inside here? Uh it did paint one of the walls in here. That's fine. Let's paint that. Um no worries there. It'll be kind of like an overall overall paint color for our boat here. Um, perfect. Uh, maybe even the deck too. Yeah, it keeps it from being so white. All right. Um, so that's done. Let's paint our doors. I need to paint the doors. They just look weird now. Uh, paint the door there. Come on. Door. 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 This door. And all these guys. You paint you. Come on. You, oh, we got the ceiling we got to worry about too. Now that I've painted the entire boat, I think I'm actually going to go back and we're going to do some white in here to actually make this place look a little more sterile. Um, I think what we can do is maybe the countertop here. That's not white. Uh, we'll do the countertop here. That's not white. Oh, it's just dark in here. That is white. Okay, so we'll do the countertop. Anything medical related. There we go. We'll do that. We'll come across there with that. No, 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 no. We don't want to do that. We want to keep that the same color. And actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to save this color here. So we're going to click uh, Add to Custom Colors, and we're just going to pick one of these slots here. And now we have our medical green saved. Perfect. Okay. Uh, so that makes this look a little more sterile in here. Let's get that right there. I think that's good. And this all looks like it's part of it. So we'll go across there. Nice. Perfect. When you look in, it feels you know, all this. It's like I made a terrible decision making it cream. I like the I like the color of the rest of the boat. In here needs to be clean. And we did it again. Alright, so we're gonna paint all this, paint all this, paint all this. I'm just gonna repaint this entire room. Back to white, I think. All right, I've got the whole room uh, painted back up. I did not paint this wall. We'll just call it an accent wall because I don't want to have to repaint the door and the window here. Uh, until they fix it where you can paint on both sides, we're just going to leave it the cream color. So yeah, we got our med bay. Feels like it's kind of done. Uh, we could put a light in here somewhere. Let's go, let's look for lights. Let's see what kind of lights we have. 
Let's at least complete one room. Light, 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 light. Uh, let's get a small spotlight. This could be like um, an examination light. Turn it the right way. There we go. We got an exam light, and then we're going to come up into the ceiling here and put our regular lights. Let's see, we'll put one. Where's the center of the room? Is this the center of the room? Is there a center of the room? Um, well, no, there's not a center of the room. Um, so we'll do one there and one there. Extra light for the exam room. There we go. Let's come up top and figure out what changed here. Okay, there we go. Paint the mouse back. And I think the other one is right here. Yep, there we go. Perfect, done. Not a problem. The victim is okay. Don't like this edge here. Let's do... Do something like this. And then we'll get rid of a med pack. Move this. I'm spending way too much time here. Way too much time on this. And that can go there. Actually, let's do... Now that we've done that, let's do this. And then maybe this. That could work. That's going to work. Uh, we're just going to leave it like that for now. Oh, God, that looks ugly right here, though. Because um, it was even with that. What's under here? Exterior. All right, so that's why we did that. All right, no worries. All right, you know what? I want to spawn it in. I want to see how this looks actually on the water. Uh, let's walk through, see what kind of problems we have with it. Um, there's our first problem. Do we have a hole somewhere? Did I make a hole and not realize it? Take a look. Oh, no, no, no. Don't see any holes. I think it was our loss of, uh, you know what we need to do? Let's do this. Let's put our weight back. Because even if we have fuel in there, if we run out of fuel... We're going to put our weight blocks back because even if we run out of fuel, if we don't have that ballast, we're, we're donezo. Come on, grab that weight block. There we go. I'm pretty sure that's what it was. We're going to have to have this. Spawn that back in. See what that does. Something's... I broke something somewhere. I broke something somewhere. Where is it? Where is it? Let's do this to make this easier. Let's make this a color that we can see. I'm not seeing any holes. I don't understand why it's... It's because we added weight to it. That's about the only thing. Uh, let's check under... Check behind these tires. Yeah, I'm not... We're going to have to figure that out. Um, More weight, I guess. More weight in the back. God, that's going to suck. All right, well, let's... uh. I know it looks ridiculous. I'm not sure what to do about this lean anymore. Um, did that med bay really do that to us? There's no way. Let's look at it at the table. Let's look at where our balance point is. Okay, center line. We are right down it, aren't we? It's slightly off. I mean, just slightly, but dang, come on. All right, let's do this. Let's put a fluid spawner in here and see if this changes things. Fluid meter, fluid spawner. That should give it to us on both sides there. How's it going to sit now? I'm at, I'm at a loss. I don't know what to do. Um... I do not know how to fix this balancing issue. Oh, sh shucks. Um, I don't know. Oh, gosh. Are we going to make the boat bigger? Or maybe this top half smaller? I don't want to have to change it much. Oh, that's going to suck. Uh, we can get this working. I know we can get this working. Um, I'm about to do some, some offline off recording, figuring out and see what's going on here. But I think I'm gonna leave it with that to get day guys. We did get our stuff built in. We got our 
We do need some painting to do. Uh, we got some painting to do. We got our med bay in. We got our areas laid out. Hangout area, galley, captain's quarters, crew quarters, engine room has been divided up. Um, we've broken the boat, uh, which sucks big time. If you if you guys have any clues of what I can do to help this this uh, balancing issue without having to change things. I don't want to change things. It's going to be sad if we have to change things. I do have big plans for this. I hope we can get this working. Uh, let's just slap, you know what? Let's, for science, let's, uh, let's slap a bunch more weight in the back here. Let's just bring a whole bunch of weight here. That's a lot. Jeez. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Problems, problems, problems. Uh, maybe we'll bring this keel out some more. Uh, let's try that. I think we're just too high with our with our weight. All right, so let's take this out of here. And then we'll come down. Let's just copy and paste this. I think that'll be the easiest thing to We're gonna grab all this, grab this, grab that, grab that. Okay, so that's all of it. We're leaning to the front. So let's bring, let's copy this and bring it to the back. A lot of weight. Let's see what it does. Um, Let's paste it. Let's merge it. We'll fix that later. Spawn it in. I don't know what's going on. Um, I, I just don't want to waste you guys' time sitting there doing this on a on a video. So I'm gonna try to figure out this uh in my own time. Guys, thanks so much for watching. If you haven't already, subscribe to this channel. It does help us out a lot. We are gonna continue with this. We are gonna get this working. Um, I just don't know how. But yeah, thanks a lot, guys. Uh, do comment down below. Let me know if you do know how to fix this. Let me know what you think about this series. Drop a like on this video. And yeah, we'll see you next time. I just want to show you that I did get this thing stable. It's taken a while to kind of figure out what's going on. And honestly, it was just too short. Uh, so what I did was extended the boat. And I've brought more of the weight to the back here. Uh, it is working currently. We're going to have to keep probably tweaking this thing a little bit as this boat goes along. Because it's still... Still got some lean to it. There's a lot of weight going on up front and up top. We got to do a lot back here to kind of counter, counterbalance that a little bit. Maybe uh, some sort of crane on the back could help balance that out. I don't know, future builds. But I just figured I'd show you that. It is floating and it is upright. Uh, it is listing a little bit, but that's, that's a lot better than it rolling over. Uh, so yeah, thanks for watching.